Mikey. What happened? <laughs> I I did something bad, Miyuki. What what did you do? I made them better. They're better now. <laughs> What's wrong, little sis? Do you not like the present I gave you? Good morning, sweetie. Listen, I understand that you don't like your birthday, but I at least wanted to do something special for you. Don't worry, sweetie. We're not gonna have confetti rain or balloon parties or anything like that. Nothing over the top. I promise. Thanks, honey. Honey? I thought I was phone charger. <laughs> <coughs> What's that supposed to mean? You are a phone charger! <laughs> I love you so much. Uh, I love you too! Mayuki, happy birthday! DON'T FUCKING TOUCH ME! Jeez, how did we manage to get a reservation in this place? Well, you kind of threatened the snobby reservationist when we got here. Hello there, sir. We're here to inquire about our reservation under the name Takashima. Is something wrong, sir? I'm sorry, but your reservations are not here. Huh? I could have sworn the last person I asked said we were on the list. Listen, kid. Your clothes are not suitable for a place like this. Therefore, I cannot help you. <laughs> what the? Unhand me, you- Listen here, you pretentious fuck. If you don't fucking give us our reservation tickets the second, I will personally turn you into a main course entree! T -t 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 Takashima, right? Uh, uh, my my mistake, sir. I must have overlooked the list. <laughs> here, here you are. Thank you so much. Let's go now, sweetie. I still can't believe that pretentious fuck had the audacity to lie to you like that. Well, don't worry, sweetie. I think you made him a new man by scaring him like that. <laughs> we have a reserva- Oh, no, 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 sir. Th th that won't be necessary. Uh, uh, uh right this way. Uh, follow me. So, uh, what can I get the both of you for, uh, uh drinks? Ah, yes, drinks. 
Uh, iced tea for me, sir. Iced tea for me as well. Also, fuck off! <laughs> Are you having a good time though, Miyuki? Yeah, I needed this. Honestly, I'd rather celebrate my birthday with you, and only you. You help keep the bad thoughts away. No problem, Miyuki. Just like how you're always protecting me, I'll protect you too. So, how was the day? Do I get a perfect Miyuki score? Oh my god! Kato, go block him off! I'll chase after the guy! I don't know about you, but I usually make withdrawals at the bank. Don't you agree, sweetie? Yep. So hand over the bag or I'll make sure not to bash your head in too much. No! <sighs> Wrong, kid. Does that anger you? <laughs> come on, come on, Miyuki. Get some help. Miyuki! Oh, thank god you're okay. You stupid heroes won't stop me! You sure about that? This is Red Riot. I need an ambulance into my coordinates. Stat. We have a villain apprehended and an injured civilian. has been a case that has certainly shocked the city. However, recent speculation from all goers, investigators, and heroes show that the murders may have a connection to a series of unsolved killings that have occurred throughout Japan over the past few years. In a similar fashion, the bodies were found dead, but in a slight difference, with only one gunshot wound. Are you on a Takashima? Yes, that's me. Alright, uh, I have some good news. That being, she has made a full recovery. That's great. Uh, however, I do have some bad news. Uh, that being, well... Miyuki, you're okay! Miyuki? What's wrong? Who... who are you? What? What's wrong with my adopted niece? Due to being struck by a memory erasing quirk, well, she lost her memories. The heroes are currently questioning said villain, 
as I have already informed them of this situation. But don't worry, Miss Takashima, we will update you on the situation. For now, we would like to do some tests on Miyuki to make sure she is stable enough to go home. Don't worry, Sweeney. We aren't going to hurt you. My name is Anna Takashima, and this is Keito. Do you remember Keito? Wow, you're Keito? You got so big! Yeah, uh, do you remember anything else? Uh, about me? <laughs> no, sorry Kato, I don't remember anything. Don't worry, I'll help you remember, okay? Did you guys hear that Miyuki is coming back from the hospital? It was a villain attack, right? Yeah, Kato texted me. He said he's bringing Miyuki with him and... Oh, there they are! Miyuki, I'm glad you're okay. Do you remember me? Does she remember anything else besides you? I'm afraid not. K Kato, who are they? Don't worry, Miyuki. Those are our other friends. That's Miki, Masaki, Akari, and Akane. Oh, hello! My name is Miyuki Homura! Nice to meet you! Oh no, I, uh, must have forgotten to bring a pencil to class today. Um, Yuki? I, uh, need to borrow a p pencil. Do you have one? Oh, you need a pencil? Uh, sure, I've got a spare one right here. There you go. Oh, uh, thank you, Miyuki. You're welcome. Huh, something isn't right here. Alright, before we get into today's session, you might have noticed that Miyuki is back in class today, and she's a little different. What do you mean, Mr. Aizawa? Miyuki has amnesia. She has been hit by a memory erasing quirk due to a villain. He's been arrested, so there's no need to worry about that. However, Miyuki only remembers Kato from her childhood memories. Oh. Due to this unfortunate incident, I encourage some of you to at least try to regain some of her knowledge and memories. Just because she is different now doesn't mean she is not one of our own. So keep that in mind. Yes, Mr. Aizawa! Yuki, I know this might be the tenth time I've asked you, but can you please wear a necktie? I have a spare one here if you need it. Oh, um, I can't exactly wear neckties. They kind of suffocate me whenever I wear one. I'm sorry. Ah, I see. Very well then. Sorry if I bother you about it a lot. It's okay! Hey Miyuki! I was wondering if I could borrow some of your notes from class today. Oh, sure! Here you go! Oh my god, you're a lifesaver, Miyuki. Thanks! Is it just me, or are some of these guys not even trying to help regain Miyuki's knowledge or memories? 
now that you mention it, it does seem odd that we haven't seen another student try to help. Yeah, it seems like we're the only ones that are even trying. Why is that? I'm starting to suspect that some people don't want Miyuki to come back. They just like her because she's the complete opposite of who she was. What? Why would they do that, Kato? Because, unlike us, they just think she's just an angry girl that bullies people. But we know that she's more than that. She's right. We're all here for the same reason. To become heroes, and taking advantage of someone like this is not hero-like at all. It's disgusting. Anyways, we should start helping Miyuki jog her memory right now. Yeah, I don't think I can stand this anymore. Hello? Uh, hello, is this Miss Anatakshima? Yes, this is her speaking. Well, we have some uh, information uh, that you need to hear, so I'd recommend you listen closely. Alright, I'm listening. We found out how the memory erasing quirk actually works. Uh, when a subject is uh, hit by the uh, quirk, they have approximately three days to regain their memories, or else... <laughs> or else... what? Or else the... she'll steal that way forever. What do we do? What you need to do is get her home immediately, and start exposing her to all the memories you can think of. I recommend uh, getting Kato as well. Uh, I mean, the bigger the memory, the more likely of a chance it'll work. Alrighty then. This new Miyuki is amazing! I know! Much better than the other one. She was a big meanie! Can you believe the nerve of what they're saying? We're supposed to be heroes in training, but here they are, supporting a villain's action. It's unforgivable. I honestly can't believe they're acting like everything is better. It's only gotten worse because of that. Makes my blood boil. I never want Miyuki to change. Do you have no fucking shame? Miki! I'm sorry, but I can't take this shit anymore! Oh? Did I do something wrong? I can assure you, what you did was definitely wrong. Yeah, how are you guys gonna say stuff like that to one of our classmates? You'll want to talk? I thought you'd be happy with the new Miyuki. She practically picked on you all the time. And what you're doing here is even worse than that. What exactly are we doing here that's bad? We're just speaking the truth. Speaking the truth? All we're seeing is some heroes in training, supporting a villain's action. What? What? She's right, you know. Kenji, you too? You and Miyuki never agreed on anything before. Why the sudden change? She's our classmate, Gorman. That's not gonna change. As a class rep, I'm honestly disappointed in you all. I have not and will not agree with your actions. Same here. Miyuki is one of us. Why should Miyuki even come back? How dare you say that about her? Who do you think you are, saying something like that? Miyuki is the most kind-hearted person I've ever met in my life. She may have been a hothead, but she has a big heart. A bigger heart than any of yours. She would lay down her life for anyone here, and I mean anyone. Even Katsu, and you know I'm right about that. We all saw it for ourselves when we were practicing the hostage exercise. Wait a minute. Yeah, he's right. She saved Katsu's life during the exercise. 
Like I said, she would lay down her life for anyone, and you think you're just gonna get away with saying some shit like that in a place like this? I hope Mr. Aizawa hears about this. That won't be necessary. I heard everything. I cannot believe what I've been hearing throughout the day. I specifically requested you all try and help her, but it seems as if only Kato, Katsu, Akari, Akane, Miyiki, Masaki, Jin, and Kenji are making an effort. But, but... It upsets me knowing that some of you are taking advantage of your classmates like this. You are here to become heroes, not villains. I should personally expel you for your actions. I want to be a hero. Please, Mr. Aizawa. Uh, we we're, we're sorry. Then from this day forward, you will treat your classmates with respect and dignity. It's fine not to like a person, but saying the things you did makes you look like a villain. This is UA High, not the League of Villains tryouts. Get your act together or else you'll be saying hello and goodbye on your way out. Do I make myself clear? Yes, Mr. Aizawa. Good. Now everyone, please take your seats. Kato, I need to see you for a minute. Miyuki, come along as well. Miyuki, please stand by the door for a few minutes. Oh, okay! So, what did you want to talk to me about, Mr. Aizawa? I just received an urgent call from your parental guardian. She informed me on some really pressing matters that is related to Miyuki's condition. What? W what does she have to say? Kato, you need to take Miyuki and go. She's on a timer, and if she does not regain her memories by sunset tomorrow, she'll stay like this forever. I'm gonna let you two skip class for tomorrow since this is a pressing matter. Your guardian is waiting downstairs for you. What? Gone forever? Time is of the essence, Kato. Take me again and go, before it's too late. Okay. Thank you, Mr. Aizawa. Do you... remember prom? Prom? We had prom? Yeah, and after that, we got together, like, as a couple. Do you remember that? Kato, I... I want to remember, but it hurts! Maybe mom and dad can help me. Where are they? Oh, uh, here. I'll take you to them. What, what happened to my house? Kato, why does my house look like this? Where are my parents? Come on, I know where they are. Kato, why are we here? Kato, please answer me. You're scaring me.
Kato? I... They're alive! They're- Miyuki, those are your parents. They died a long time ago, remember? I did something bad, Miyuki. What? What did you do? I made them better. They're better now. <laughs> What's wrong, little sis? Do you not like the present I gave you? What the hell? Well, uh, Kaito told us how every year on your birthday you didn't want to celebrate it because of bad memories. But we we want to help you change that, Miyuki. You got me a present. Are you shitting me, Chicken Katsu? Like hell I would accept a present from you, you damn nerd! Thanks for the present though, Katsu. I really appreciate it. Miyuki. Happy birthday, Miyuki! Happy birthday. Yeah, yeah, thanks! Jeez, let's just start this party! Thanks, Katsu. Oh, don't thank me. This was everyone's idea. It's the least I can do. Miyuki's our classmate, so it's only right she remembers her birthday in the best way as possible. Hey, phone charger! Chicken Katsu! We got a party or what? Oh, coming. Let's go, Katsu. Right! Happy birthday, little sis. <laughs> the recent Musatafu murders has been a case that has certainly shocked the city. 
However, recent speculation from ongoers, investigators, and heroes show that the murders may have a connection to a series of unsolved killings that have occurred throughout Japan over the past few years. In a similar fashion, the bodies were found dead, but in a slight difference, with only one gunshot wound. Oh, Muzutafu, when will you learn from your mistakes? I killed those teenagers because they were a disgrace. I'll rid this place of heroes once and for all, while I stand in the shadows and watch the city fall.